Mr. Kamal Yafarov from Azerbaijan. Kamal. Thank you very much, Mr. President. Dear colleagues, if there is any blockade, it's definitely an artificial information blockade conceived by those powers who wanted to divert attention from the war in Ukraine. An advisor to the Ukrainian president, Mikhailo Padalyak, gave a public interview to the Moldovan public television. And in his interview, he said that the issues regarding Lachin Corridor are being artificially inflated with an incorrect data on the size of local population in Hankandi with one specific intent to distract attention from the war in Ukraine. My colleagues, if there is a crisis, it's definitely a political one, and which was initiated with the Ruben Vardanyan plan. Ruben Vardanyan is Russian criminal oligarch. On 2019, European Parliament demanded an investigation into activities of the Ruben Vardanyan while he was the head of Troika Dialogue Investment Bank, which later was acquired by Sberbank of Russian Federation. Ruben Vardanyan was sent from Moscow with open and clear agenda. His first mission is the damage the peace process, damage the established contacts with local Armenians, and his second mission is, my dear Armenian colleagues, is throw out the Pashinyan from the power and to become next Prime Minister of Armenia. And that's the another reason of this information manipulation for the rivalry between Pashinyan and Ruben Vardanyan. My dear colleagues, if there is a humanitarian concern, it's definitely the concern of the 282 victims of landmines planted by Armenia. Armenians abusing Lachin Corridor planted mines which was made by Armenia in 2021. A number of the cars are passing through the Lachin Corridor. In the last two months, are three times more than member of this parliamentary assembly. Is more than 1,000 cars, including peacekeeping, International Red Cross, even including civil Armenian cars. But the number of the cars are passing through the Zengezir Corridor is zero, which Armenia also promised to open interlateral agreement. My message is to the local Armenians in Khan Kandi, throughout the Ruben Vardanyan, yourself for yourself. Our message to the Pashinyan, don't believe false promises made by France. We already, the whole world already seen how the France kept his promise for Ukrainian cause. Thank you very much. Thank you, uh, Kamal. Now I call on the debate.